Hello everyone and welcome to Restaurant Archaeology. Today we're going to be taking a look at Oregon Stop Pizza in Mesa, Arizona. Now this particular location opened in 1995, but Oregon Stop Pizza has its roots all the way back in 1972. Now here's a look inside, and I don't think this place has been updated since this location opened in 1995, which I absolutely love. Now, originally the first Oregon Stop Pizza location opened in 1972 in Phoenix, Arizona, and then a second location was opened in 1975 in Mesa, Arizona. Let's get a closer look at their menu here. And it's very simple. It's pizza, salad, soda, beer, and they've got like an ice cream counter on the uh, other side around there. But like I mentioned, the Mesa location originally opened in 1975. But then in 1984, the original owner sold both locations. The Phoenix location was sold to a real estate developer who closed it and uh, demolished it, unfortunately. And then the other location in Mesa was sold to somebody who was formerly a manager. And then in 1995, the Mesa location was closed and moved to a much bigger location, which is the one we're looking at here, that opened in 1995. All of the musical instruments and everything hanging all over the place are all hooked up to what they claim is the largest Wurlitzer theater organ in the world. Let's get a closer look at the organ. This organ unveiling happens about half an hour after opening each night and takes about two and a half minutes total to complete. I've cut it down here a little bit, but everything you see here is hooked up to that organ. Now let's go back outside for a moment because I want to show you the huge pipes that are hooked up to it that you can see in the window there. And there's actually some information painted on some of the windows and you can see some of the turbines and stuff that run all of this. I actually didn't know any of this information and stuff was out here, so this is actually my first time seeing it, even though I had come here quite a bit as a kid. These pizza and pipes places used to be a big deal. There were almost 150 of them in the United States back in the 1980s. Now there's only three left. And here's a, a closer look at those uh, turbines, at least as close as I can get through the windows. This was a pretty neat thing to see, having never seen it before. And here's a closer look at those colorful pipes that you can see off the main road when you drive by. Unfortunately, the sun didn't cooperate very well with me here, but I'll give you the, the best shot that I can. It's funny because I can actually remember the last time I came here as a kid and it was with a friend of mine right after we had actually finished beating the game Toe Jam and Earl on the Sega Genesis. And then I don't think I ever came here again after that until much later in my adult life. My daughter really loves this place. I was actually uh, taking her here. That's why we were here. And here's a closer look at the pizza. Got to show the pizza. And it's, it's pretty decent. It's not fantastic, but it's not bad either. The cheese stretches nicely. Here's some more of the uh, organ music. And this is really just an interesting place to eat dinner. They play a mix of like old show tunes, some modern music. They played some songs from like Moana and stuff like that. I didn't record a lot of that for copyright reasons because I didn't want to get strikes on YouTube. But if you're ever in Mesa, Arizona and looking for an interesting place to eat, I would highly recommend this place. The prices aren't bad either. Uh, the one complaint I do have is they are cash only. So they, they do have an ATM in the front, but it's just easier to bring cash. One of the things I do love about this place, though, is that it seems to remain untouched from when I was a kid. 
including these weird ass cats that dance in the wall. They only come out for this one particular song as far as I can remember. Something else interesting I found out while doing research for this video is that there was another similar place like this in San Diego, California called Orkin Power Pizza. Now I'm sure you'll recognize this tune. I was trying to run over and film the uh, bucket drums that were going. If you look quick, you can see them go for a second. Now those are some horns. Please uh, let me know what you think of this pilot episode of Restaurant Archaeology. Is this something I should continue doing in the future, covering interesting restaurants or sometimes restaurants that are dead or dying? Let me know down in the comments below. And also if you have any memories of Oregon Stop Pizza or Oregon Power Pizza in San Diego, let me know about those down in the comments below. Let's take a one last quick look at the lobby, and uh, right there is the gift shop, which we'll take a closer look at that at the end, and they also have a small arcade. Every self-respecting pizza place has to have at least a small arcade. And there's some interesting games in here. You've got Cruisin' World, there's a uh, Galaga cocktail table back there, and a uh, Simpsons pinball machine. And you've got your prize redemption games. Here's a closer look at that Simpsons uh, pinball party game. The older Simpsons pinball machine used to be here. That's what was here the last time I was here. So I was surprised to see this table in its place. And here's the uh, Galaga cocktail table. I love seeing those. Decent selection of games though. And here's uh, one quick last look at the gift shop area. They've got CDs you can purchase of the uh, different musicians that play the organ here. And tons of these uh, TY Beanie Baby and Beanie Boo things. My daughter loves these and collects them. So of course I got, I would say suckered. Yeah, pretty much suckered into getting her one while we were here. And they've got those uh, t-shirts there, of course. You gotta have the t-shirts. Man, I love the wood paneling all throughout this place. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the video with a 1970s commercial for that place I discovered that used to be in San Diego, California, uh, Oregon Power Pizza. As always, everyone, thanks for watching. At Oregon Power Pizza, when you say music, and pizza that means party your whole family will love the mammoth sounds of 888 pipes cymbals bells and drums music and dancing and crowd pleasing pizza pepperoni mushroom or the works join in the fun and move up to organ power pizza trinity villa road and claremont mesa boulevard